Saying good evening to my viewers on Highway 11 between Hearst and Cochrane, including Captain Casing. There's a couple of isolated clusters of light snow slowly but gradually moving over Highway 11 between the hours of 7 o'clock and 9 o'clock this evening. And I'm pointing this out because this is the only area of active weather observed or reported across Highway 11. Because Capus Casing, you settled with an overcast sky all day today. No snowfall, yet it wasn't a forecast. Timmins, you had some light freezing drizzle mixed with snow on and off throughout the day today. That wasn't a forecast, and that certainly did happen. And so too did some slippery, slippery surfaces, but no reports of injuries. So it's just been a bit of a quiet, dull, humid type day. Where is this humid day coming from? Well, number one, Southeast winds continuing from a low pressure system over Sioux Falls, South Dakota, which will become our weekend weather maker. That same low is maintaining this frontal boundary that I had talked about last night. It's this long line crossing over the Great Lakes, cutting across the Sioux, Sudbury, North Bay sectors as well. Warm and cold air together. The humidity is very high. Temperature, your temperature is minus four, dew point minus five, and that means the humidity is in the high 90% range. So it feels very moist or very humid outside, which is why we also have some mist and some fog patches, which may occur for tonight's forecast. So there's a bit of a sneak peek into what to expect there. Not to mention as well, not too many details just yet, but this is the weekend weather maker, which could move over the Great Lakes and produce a few days in a row worth of significant snowfall. I'll stop right there. You have a good evening. Check out my templates and we'll have your report tomorrow morning at around 8 o'clock.